in overts. Scrutinizing contemporary tech. Kindly subscribe to my channel. Like this video and share with your friends. Thanks, the Internet of Things, refers to the billions of physical devices around the world that are now connected to the Internet, collecting, sharing and analysis of data. I will focus on these areas by starting with Defining the IoT How the IoT works IoT applications Development of the IoT Benefits of the IoT IoT implementation challenges And at the end, about myself, the Internet of Things is the network of physical devices that combine IP connectivity with software, sensors, actuators, and other electronics to directly integrate the physical world into our computer-based systems, resulting in efficiency improvements and economic benefits, in available technology. There are thousands of devices that facilitate and enhance human work. Automate the industries. Transform the medical field. And connect the whole world to reduce the distance of communication are some of the achievements of IAN. The IEEE has compiled data and claims that in 2015, the global wearables market had already increased by 223% from the previous year and data on Statista shows it increasing by another 243% between 2015 and 2022. By 2020, 250 million vehicles will be connected to the Internet. IoT will add $15 trillion to the global economy over the next 20 years. There will be 50 billion internet-connected devices by the year 2020. IoT is enabled by the following factors. Miniaturization. Connectivity. Advanced power sources and power management. Inexpensive processors, sensors, and actuators. Cloud-based processing. Ubiquitous computing. How to gain IoT maturity. Well, there are three points I have mentioned over here. Improve operations with data from IoT. Use IoT to create new products or services. Transform your business model with data-led insights. There are plenty of different categories of IoT devices and services. But I am highlighting only two of them. Industrial Internet of Things and Consumer Internet of Things. In Consumer Internet of Things. It largely consists of commercial devices and associated services that are geared towards home or personal use such as connected thermostats or appliances. While the basic IoT concepts apply, the scope of what the devices collect, how they manage and store data, and how the data is used may be much more limited than what you'd find in an enterprise environment. Whereas consumer IoT is focused on turnkey device solutions that solve specific problems or enable new scenarios for individuals or homes. Enterprise class IoT is focused on solving specific business problems like efficiency, reducing waste, increasing speed to market or of production, and providing intelligence on how business systems are running. A single enterprise may deploy dozens of devices that work in concert to give a business a single view of a factory or a fleet of planes or gas pipeline. Enterprises also may require real-time data and real-time analysis of those data in order to make just-in-time adjustments or prevent disastrous consequences from a failed system. Consumer-grade IoT products rarely require this so the type of architecture needed in an enterprise will be more involved and require more services than a consumer solution requires. Technology is evolving very rapidly day by day. You can see in the timeline how expensive and less efficient devices are replaced and improved by the latest and fast one. In 2013 the Internet of Things was introduced. In 2022 software defined autonomous world is predicted. IoT devices can be categorized into following three types of devices. Devices which collects and send information. Receive and act on information. And devices that can do both operations. There are many benefits of IoT but particularly for business, these are the benefits that they can get directly from it. Business process monitoring. Improved customer experience. Better business decisions.
in 2020 20.4 billion are devices that are connected to the internet. 4,381,400 IoT units installed in the cross industry business category. 3,171,000 IoT units installed in the vertical specific business category. According to statistics, billions of dollars are spent on IoT every year. IoT is implemented in three steps measurement, automation, and innovation. Implementation challenges include security, privacy, compliance, market fragmentation, legacy infrastructure, LAN slash WAN connectivity, underutilized data, interoperability, standards.